The Daily Court caught up with Andrew J. West at the Walker Stalker Fan Fest, and we're bringing you the exclusive interview. So this one in particular, this is such a cool menu. I mean, I wish we did them at, at venues like this more often, but um, the conventions in general, it's always fun to just talk to fans and just get their perspective on the show and hear about what they appreciate and what they think about and what they like and, you know, what they don't like, whatever, whatever they have to say about the show. So that's always interesting and fun. Speaking of the fans, are you surprised by the strong following the show has? No, you know, I mean, I, I, it's, a, it's such a good show, you know, and I, I, well, I think everybody was surprised by what a phenomenon it became, uh, you know, especially after season one, maybe season two, um, but now seeing the quality of the show, seeing, you know, the, the, uh, the, the level that the show delves into, the, the complexity of what it is to be a human being, or what it is to survive, or what it is to survive when, when you're faced with extraordinary circumstances like, like what you see in The Walking Dead, it makes sense that it would be as successful as, as it is, you know, it's, it's just uh, it's quality TV. And now you're on um, Under the Dome, so what's that yeah. been like? Yeah, yeah, that was fun, that was fun. The first episode I did just aired. Um, you know, it's another one of those sort of phenomenon shows. It's got a really big following, too, and there's sort of a supernatural element, and uh, it's exciting. It's exciting. I can't talk too much about it because I don't want to spoil anything because my, you know, there's there's more to come with my with my character on that show. But, uh, yeah, it'll be interesting to see how that all plays out Can you tease Chester's little? Mill. Oh, okay. Can yeah. Well, can I tease a little bit? Uh, well, Pete, my character... Um, <laughs> There is a little bit more to him than initially meets the eye. He's sort of a complicated character, not unlike Garrett, really. You know, he's not. It's not going to get as weird as it got with Garrett, I don't think. But uh, it's it, there's more to Pete than meets the eye.